calculate the ratio of CH3NH2 to CH3NH3Cl concentration required to create a buffer with pH of 10.22. The KV given is 4.47 times 10 to the negative 4. So this is um, a buffer problem. So we will make use of the famous henderson hasselbalch equation. So that would be pH is equal to pKa plus log of the concentration of base divided by the concentration of the acid. Okay, so in the problem, our base is CH3NH2, which is methylamine, and our acid is the other substance, CH3NH3Cl. So basically in the problem, it's asking for the ratio of base to acid. So basically we are solving for this, the base over acid ratio. Okay, so in the problem, we are given the pH, which is 10.22. So just substitute that to the formula. 10.22. And that's equal to the pKa. So in the problem, we are not given the Ka. We are given the Kb. So what we need to do first is solve for the Ka. So how do you get the Ka from Kb? So Ka is Kw divided by Kb. And we know, although it's not given in the problem, that the Kw is 1 times 10 to the negative 14 divided by the given Kb is 4.47 times 10 to the negative 4. So if you solve this in your calculator, 1 times 10 to the negative 14 divided by 4.47 times 10 to the negative 4, you will get approximately 2.237 times 10 to the negative 11. So that's your Ka. In the henderson hasselbalch equation, we need the pKa. So we know that pKa is equal to the negative log of the Ka. So we will get negative log of the 2.237 times 10 to the negative 11. And that is approximately equal to 10.65. So we will plug this now into our equation. Our pKa is 10.65 plus the log of base over acid. So next, what you're going to do is you will transfer 10.65 to the other side, and it becomes a negative. So 10.22 minus 10.65, that's equal to the log of the ratio of base over acid. So I'll just write it as B over A. Okay, so on the left side, you now have 10.22 minus 10.65. That's equal to negative 0 0.43. And that's equal to the log of base over acid. Okay, so what's next? What we want is just the ratio of base over acid. So we want to remove the log. So how do we do that? So let's continue our calculation here. So if you want to remove the log on the right side, 
so that your right side is just base over acid. What you're going to do is you're gonna do 10 raised to whatever is on the other side. So 10 raised to negative 0 0.43. So if you do that in your calculator, so 10 raised to negative 0 0.43, you will get 0 0.37. So the ratio of base over acid is 0 0.37, and that is the answer to the question.